Oh my God, a mess. Look at that. Ooh. Winter. <laughs> All right, back at the shop. Been working on the wash lately. I had a, a, a new support here because I was worried it was too weak. I got this one done too. And then I started to uh, build the side there, the back part too. That's what I'm gonna be working on today. But last week I did some testing. I also cut the, the screen. I had the screen here and I did some testing last week and I had a little bit of sand. I, I went outside and dug some sand in the backyard. Wonder if it's frozen now. Oh no, it's okay. I'm gonna do more testing today because last week I put the sand right there and uh, realized I might be too steep, but I can always modify this later. But what I did is I, I clamped the motor. I have a small vibrating motor and I clamp it here. When I put the sand there, I noticed that this part here was moving sand faster than this part, so. I realize I might gonna need two vibrating motors. And uh, I'm gonna do the testing today. I'll put the vibrating motor right here instead of in the middle. I wanna see if it's gonna move the, the sand more evenly on both sides here. Let's do some testing. Yes! I'm gonna clamp the motor right here in the middle, just like that. Okay, new test with the vibrating motor in the middle there. See how much time it takes to move this dirt down there. but I can uh, modify the uh, vibrating motor to make it move slower. I'll, I'll try that. So here's the motor. I need to remove those Allen key screws so I can access the, the counterweight. I'm gonna find the, the counterweight uh, assembly. So here's the counterweight. I'm gonna try to, there's five of them. Move two of them this far and it should reduce the vibration and then the speed of the feeding. So I'll move the counterweight here so it should produce less vibration, so it should reduce the speed. Well, we'll go and try it. Okay, test number two. I moved the counterweight. I want to try to reduce the speed, so it takes about 20 seconds to, to run this dirt. Oh yeah, that's too slow. Nah, too slow. It doesn't move. Too slow move the counterweight again so i have it move i moved it five notch this way i'm gonna bring it back three notch and see what it does okay new test i think it's still too slow yeah but it's better getting somewhere a little bit faster but uh, I kind of like it oh yeah pretty good a little faster Okay. I'll 
put more weight. Yeah, I'm gonna move the counterweight a little bit more. I want it to be a little faster. Okay, not a test. All right, that's probably the, nah, maybe a little slow too. Yes, see what the difference gonna be if I move the vibrator at this location right there. Gonna put the dirt back up there and see what the difference makes. Okay, I'm gonna test with the uh, vibrating motors. Move the down there. Let's see what it does. Move the counterweight all the way down here i'll put back all the counterweight doing another test down here let's see what it does counterweight down there is pretty good or maybe what i'm gonna do is i'll modify the upper platform but yeah i think it's great i can start building the sides here working pretty good work in progress stay tuned okay one more test so i put all the counterweight back on and i moved it in the middle i can't temporarily welded the strings Let's see how it's gonna react let's try this Okay, one more test. end up doing is i'll buy um because this motor is not meant for this it was for other purposes but what i'm gonna do is i'll add another another motor around there bigger ones 
and then with more dirt because I'm going to do more testing in the springs mm, and yeah two motors bigger ones it should work perfect so I'm going to work on this uh, that side building that side there test with a bigger counter weight welded a like a big bolt to see how it would react with a bigger can of weight yeah it's getting there i'll definitely need bigger motors